Well, it's Tuesday, 16th of March, here in the goat shed. Slightly overcast day. We've got Graham reassembling a stepper here at the moment. Um, I think we counted 15 steppers in this machine. They've all been cleaned. Everything's all been done on them. They come up quite nicely when you do them. Um, each stepper has been given a bit of that PBR grease to help it move smoothly. There's another one we've done. So this is the front of the machine. This is how they, they fold down on a bingo, for those of you that, that don't know about that. Um, so we've still got a lot more work to do. That that big hole there is where the magic screen unit goes. We've we've got that out in the other shed at the moment. So what we have to do, we're, we've done, we've got to do that. That unit there is called the mixer unit. Now that has a couple of leather clutches in there that dry out. Um, they have to be replaced and they get lubricated with Neatswood oil. That's a bit of a fiddly job, but we'll get there, I guess. This is the control unit. Now, all the cams at the front, I'll just go around and try and focus on that. They're all greasy and dirty, and so that we'll take those switch stacks off and we'll clean all those cams. We'll get a bit of kerosene and, and clean that in there. I'll have to do the, the search wiper. And... We're just, I'm just finishing off the reflex unit now. Just cleaning up all the, the discs. There's a broken ladder, switch ladder. They do break a lot in the trip bank on the side. So we'll have to do that. That one is the, what is it? I can't quite. I can't see that. Whatever that says there, that's that one. Yeah, so. All those steppers have all been been done. That one up there. There's a lot in these things, isn't there? There's all the Jones plugs down there. The transformer. I know we'll have to do something with the fuse fuses, I'd imagine. The fuse blocks normally normally go. After all, it is a bally. And their fuse blocks were notorious for being bad. So, a little bit more, or quite a lot more to do on this this machine yet, just to show you where we're up to. Uh, some stickers you can still see on the side there. This is a 24-hole card machine, which I believe was the only one that Bally actually made. They either made 20 or 25s, which were the most popular, and this is a 24 one. So, yeah, plenty to do plenty to see. I don't know where the goat is. I think he's gone to the pub. So this has been another goat shed presentation without the goat.